Web-based programming comes in two main types, server-side programming and client-side programming. In this video, we are going to go through the pros and cons of these two types of programming. In server-side programming, the program code is run on the server hosting the website. Users can interact with the program to request their needed information from the server, but the interaction is done remotely from the user to the server. Server-side programming is very useful when the website is connected to a database such as websites of online banking or online stores. But to use server resources, internet access should be available. For example, if the system is offline, the user will have to wait until the system comes back online. In client-side programming, the code is run locally on the client machine, such as validating user entries to make sure the entered data matches the defined type. For example, if a user enters currency in the date field, the client program can check the value using a client-side program and then show an appropriate message to the user asking for entering the correct data type. Since it is run on the client machine, it is more responsive than server-side programming. However, client-side programs can never completely replace server-side programming. For example, tasks such as running a search for processing a purchase order must be run from a central server because only the server has access to this database. In most business systems, a combination of server-side and client-side programming is used. For example, data entry forms are checked with client-side programs, but entering and updating data in a database should be done through server-side programs.